What's going on everybody? This is your boy Moses from the Entertainment Plaza. Today I'm going to show you how to get PlayStation Remote Play on your Steam Deck. You can play PS5, PS4, and PS4 Pro on your Steam Deck with Remote Play. Unfortunately, Sony hasn't given us a dedicated app to put on our Steam Deck that will make it super easy to play Remote Play like we can on our phones and tablets. But with that being said, hopefully the way I show you will get you playing your PS5, your PS4, or your PS4 Pro with Remote Play on your Steam Deck in less than 10 or 15 minutes. So with that being said, let's get to it. Okay, this is the first step we need to do to get Remote Play working on your Steam Deck. So obviously turn on your PlayStation 5. We're gonna go over to our settings, then scroll down to system, then scroll down again to Remote Play. Where it says enable remote play, make sure that's checked. I already have it checked, but you'll have to do that on your end. Then go down to link device. You're gonna get an eight digit code. This eight digit code refreshes every 300 seconds or five minutes. So make sure when we're ready to put this into our Steam Deck that you have the latest eight digit code that the PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, PS4 Pro has given you. All right, our next step after enabling remote play on our PS5, PS4, PS4 Pro is to turn on our Steam Deck. If we are in gaming mode, we need to switch over to desktop mode. So in order to do that, you can hold down your Steam button or um, if you're doing keyboard and mouse like I am, just click on the Steam menu, go to power and switch to desktop. Okay, once we're in desktop mode, you're gonna to go to the Discover app. You're gonna search for Chiaki, that's C-H-I-A-K-I, -I, and hit enter. Once you find it, you're gonna install it. I've already installed it, so I don't need to do that. Once it's installed, it takes about a minute or so, you're gonna go ahead and open it up and hit launch. Once Chiaki launches, it's actually gonna recognize your PS5, but it will be unregistered, so you won't be able to play it with Remote Play just yet. So double click on your PS5 and this tab comes up. The only thing from here that we are gonna need is your PlayStation account ID and your pin. The pin we get straight from the PS5, PS4, PS4 Pro. The PlayStation network account ID, that's where we have to make one extra step. So with that being said, we're gonna to go to your favorite browser. I prefer Google Chrome. And you're gonna to go to gamesrevealed.com slash how to play PlayStation on deck. I will leave this link in the description to make it a lot easier for you guys. So once you're there, you're gonna hit sign in to PSN. That'll pop up here in a second. You're gonna go ahead and put your email address for your sign in. Hit next and then your password. Once you do that, this page is gonna take you to another page. At the top left corner here, you're gonna see, it's gonna say redirect. And you'll see it here in a second. There you go. Once you get this message on this tab that says redirect, you're gonna click up here and copy this link. Once you have that link, you can go ahead and minimize this. Go back to gamesrevealed.com slash how to play PS on deck and put that link on step number four and paste it and then hit get ID. Once you hit get ID, you're gonna get this code. You're gonna to wanna to copy to clipboard and we're gonna go back to Chiaki and paste that into the PlayStation Network account ID. So we're gonna go here and paste. Now we got our code. Next, we need to get our pin from the PS5. So let's go back to the PS5 and get our eight digit pin. All right, now that I got my eight digit code 3284 8623, we need to go back to the Steam Deck and put that into where it says pin on Chiaki. All right, now we need to put that eight digit pin where it says pin here on Chiaki. Mine was 3284. Oops. 3284 868623. Hit register. Now it says the console PS5-281 with ID yada 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 has been successfully registered. So now technically you are good to go. You hit OK, double click on your PS5, and guess what? Voila, you are now playing with 
we remote play. And that's right. My PlayStation Network ID is XX. That is also my gamer tag on Nintendo Switch and Xbox. So yeah, now we are on remote play. I am controlling my PS5 right now with my Steam Deck, believe it or not. So that's pretty much it, guys. It's literally super easy to get remote play on your Steam Deck. Yes, we have to kind of jump through some loopholes just to get um, remote play working on the Steam Deck, but it is possible and it works great. Now, one thing I will say is that remote play will only work on the same network. You cannot be on a different network and remote play and have remote play work, unfortunately. They haven't worked out those kinks yet, but Chiaki is amazing. I've been playing in my bedroom. My PS5 is in the man cave and it works flawlessly. Now, we are technically done. Uh, we can, let's see here, we'll exit out of remote play. Hit yes. I'm gonna put my PS5 to sleep. You can do that straight from the Steam Deck as well. I'm gonna exit out of Chiaki and exit out of games, gamesrevealed.com. Now, one thing we can do is go into Steam on desktop mode, go to library, click PS5 Remote Play if, it's a, if it isn't already up, and we can get a banner like you see here where it says PS5. We can rename Chiaki to PS5 Remote Play, and we can get icons for various other things when you go into the Steam store. So what you wanna do is click the cog, it says manage click properties and you can actually click right here where the playstation symbol is and choose any icon so i have it right here as icon and then open and i'll put the icon right here you can name it whatever you want so i put a ps5 remote play that's what i wanted it to say and you hit enter so once that's done you can click out of that and then for the banner all you got to do is right click on the banner and hit set custom logo. And then here you'll actually have to search for it. So it'll be on home deck, downloads, and then I named it uh, PS Banner when I downloaded it off the internet. Now, I know you may be asking, well, where did you get that? So one place that you can actually get it is uh, steamgriddb.com. Once you go there, all you do is type in PlayStation 5, hit enter, and then a bunch of different icons are gonna come up here. So I downloaded this one right here as a PNG. I downloaded, um, if you click on icons up here, I downloaded this icon here, and I mean, so on and so forth. You can you can download a bunch of different stuff on uh, steamgrid.db. It's actually a really great um, website to get a lot of your icons, banners, and pills. And then I actually downloaded uh, this one right here for the Steam store where you'll see the actual PlayStation 5 symbol and it's like a small banner from when you're choosing your game. So yeah, steamgriddb.com. You can get all this uh, cool stuff to put in the Steam store. So, and that's how I manage this. Once you do it on here in desktop mode and you go back to gaming mode, it'll all be in your um, Steam library, just like you see it here. And I'll show you that in a second. One thing I did forget to mention is if you're in the Steam store on desktop mode you can go to library click on the four square button here and then type in ps5 you'll see ps5 remote play came up you can actually add that to your favorites and then from there if you click favorites and then right click on ps5 remote play you can go to manage set custom artwork and then like i said before we have to go to home deck downloads and then PlayStation pill. I downloaded this on that same website and then we'll have that there. So from here, we're going to go to gaming mode and I'll show you how everything works on there fairly easily. Um, so you can do PS5 remote play on your steam deck. All right, now we're back on gaming mode. If your steam deck defaults to the steam deck store, all you got to do is go down to the steam menu library, go to your favorites. And there goes the PS5 remote play. Double click that, you can hit play. You should see your PS5 in Chiaki, go ahead and double click that. And once again, you're playing PS5 on your Steam Deck through remote play.
I hope this video was informative and helped you get your PS5 remote played onto your Steam Deck. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down in the comment section below and I will get to each and every one of them. I will also be putting the links in the description to everything I use to make this video. Once again, thank you for tuning in. Hope this helped. Until next time, peace.